what better way to introduce you to new types of fish than with a top five. And in this top five, we'll focus on patterns of freshwater aquarium fish. I know it's not that impressive, but I think the corals are heavily underrated. They come in many colors, and since we're covering patterns in this video, I thought I'd show the corals some love with the tiger color pattern of the Adolfo's Cory Catfish. It comes to us from South America, grows just under two and a half inches, and it's easy to breed, so you can have yourself a bunch of mini orange corys swimming around in your aquarium. Not all yo-yo loaches have the word yo-yo on them, but the ones that do are usually readily available. And since it's the only fish out there with somewhat of a spelled out word on it, it definitely earns a spot in our top five. Killifish are some of the most impressive freshwater fish in the world. They're quite small and only live a couple of years, but if you're into complex and colorful fish, I highly recommend you look into them. And the red polka dot pattern on this killie makes it a favorite for patterns of freshwater fish. And speaking of polka dots, what's better than a tiny green ball of polka dots that will try to kill its tank mates if they're small enough. Despite its aggressive behavior, the pufferfish is undeniably adorable and turns out to be quite popular. They come in a tiny size, although there are bigger variations if you can't get enough of them. The zebra pleco came pretty close, but the royal pleco has a black and gold pattern that is complemented by its red shaded eyes making it the top choice for patterns on a pleco. They grow extremely large and they don't have scales. Instead, they have hardened plates of skin, giving it a unique look and texture. This is first of hopefully many top five fish. I wanted a way to introduce you guys to different types of fish and this top five seemed like a good idea, but I would appreciate any ideas you guys might have to improve these top five, so please let me know and feel free to leave any questions or input down below. I hope this helps, and as always, thanks for watching.